Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm your bubbly blonde, fabulously dressed. invite into our lives. I'm not measuring up as a man. Richard Burton. You're every man there ever was. Burton and Taylor, coming soon to BBC Four. Helena, darling, first of all, you look absolutely gorgeous. Thank you very much, so do you. And congratulations on this film. But could you tell my audience, what was your biggest challenge portraying Elizabeth Taylor in this film? Well, in a way, well, obviously I had to um, portray the most famous person in the world that everyone most, has an opinion actually about. Actually, the most beautiful person you She said. is beautiful. The, the time in her life that this drama takes place is actually when she's not looking the most. I mean, she's, she's not in her prime. I would, could never play in her prime. Anyway, I'm too old. So she was in her 50s. But it's um, the biggest challenge is, frankly, suspending. People talk about the suspension of disbelief. You know, of the audience when you go into, and in fact, I had to suspend my own disbelief. The, the hardest thing was believing that I could be like Elizabeth Taylor. But then you just, like any part, you work from the inside out, and uh, there was a lot of colours to her, which is why I did it because she was so multifaceted. But there's a lot of homework I had to do. So it was that, and then trying to distill it, and then try and always get the balance right of of not doing an impersonation and and just trying to. Uh, my thing, which was, I felt like it was like a collage, and, and I wanted to pay tribute to lots of her characteristics, her internal self. I could never do her external bit, but um, but the, and so I just learned as much as I could about her from all different biographies and friends, and I have you an had a lot. Friend. To, there was a, a lot. lot. There's a lot of information, yeah. but it's actually so much you have to go through, and you've got to distill and distill and distill, and then try. It's like bottling someone, like a, in a genie or a or a perfume, making a perfume of somebody, and so it was just, anyway, I love doing it. You did a fantastic job, I'm sure, but can you tell my audience where we can find out more information about the film? Is there a website? I know it's I going to be a website, but it is going to be on television. BBC America, yeah, right? on Wednesday. I yeah, can't I'm wait. I'll see it then. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. And we'll be back in a moment, darling, some more interviews right here at the 21st Hamptons International Film Festival. Pink Champagne Kisses. 
Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a ballet blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. It's been a Cry Baby Productions, darlings.